Howdy, Mr. Burton. My name is Joseph Graham uh, with Upshot Solutions, partnered with uh, the Lone Star Times. Um, they said you may want some uh, information about what we do over here. And what we do is help local businesses increase their online presence. How do we do this? And why do we do this? And why is an online presence even important? What I'm looking at right now is your map listing for Google. Okay. When somebody is looking for your service, they're going to do one or two things. The first thing they could do is they can ask somebody, hey, do you know anybody who does really good, you know, uh, foundation repair, who installs this here, you know, ETC, they're going to do like the word of mouth, ask around in their own circle, people they trust. The other thing they're going to do or could do is get online. When they get online, they're going to search. So when someone searches, there's going to be results, right? There's going to be some results that pop up. And these results look like this, okay? It's pulled up Fort Worth because I'm based out of Fort Worth. Uh, let's just say Dallas, right? So the first thing you see are these ads up here, people paying for ads. And beneath that, you have the map listings. Okay, this is the map listings or map pack. And then below are the organic listings. Now, people who are not here organically are trying to buy their way in. This guy's trying to buy his way in here. They're all trying to buy their way in here because they're not here organically. What I'm trying to show you right now are the key elements to getting there organically. And the first key element is having that map listing optimized okay this map listing is what anchors you in a town you want to rank in now there's a lot of companies who want to rank nationwide right but they only have one map listing okay i'm about to show you i'm showing you right now why you have to have multiple map listings to even dominate you got to have at least one map listing to dominate a city now when it comes to the dfw depending on the competition depending on the niche you could dominate the whole DFW, all, all those cities with one map listing. It's possible. I've done it. This is, this is, uh, I'm going to show you. A plus. So this is A plus. Now, originally, your map listing says you cover Oklahoma. You do serve Oklahoma. You do serve Texas. And it's fine. But you still have to have map listings centered in these company in these different cities. Like OKC, Tulsa, Houston, Lubbock, you know, you know what I mean? Like every city to help spread your domination. Like what is he talking about? This is what I'm talking about. So look, when someone searches online, they're gonna there's a 70% chance that they're gonna call one of these top three businesses right here. And then the ads only get clicked on 10% of the time, and then the organics get clicked on 20% of the time, right? So the first key element is optimizing that map listing. And since you don't have any reviews, I don't mind giving you guys a review. Really great company. Really freaking great. All right, so, so also 74% of online people or buyers look at a reviews before even making a purchasing decision. So once you got your map listing optimized, you're going to build citations and that's having your name, address and phone number on like hundreds of different sites like Facebook, you know, yellow pages. Like there, there's like literally like hundreds of different places. Here's one. Here, here's 97 of them. Right. So you got uh, Salio, this place, version it like uh, Mians. We've all heard of like Hot Frog, Yellow Pages, Yelp, uh, Allergy Eats, believe it or not. You can get a citation from any of these. Instagram, Snapchat, MapQuest, the list goes on, right? Content, the words on your website, it needs to be authoritative. It needs to be relevant. And my, I love to use this example. Like when I type in beer, like I literally type in beer, okay? Keep this in mind. Wikipedia pops up first because Wikipedia has the most content, in-depth content, relevant content, authoritative content 
on the topic of beer. So it's no different for businesses and their services. That subject matter, whether it's peer installation, concrete, beer, you need to have authoritative content on your site to make you the Wikipedia. Because the Google bots, the little search engine, the internet little critters scan your content. They scan your content to see how authoritative are you. Right? You're like, well, he says he does foundation repair, but he doesn't really talk about it. It just says foundation repair on his site. I can't load it right now. Now, this is backlinks, and this is just the juice. Okay, this is for what I do. This is what we spend a lot of money and a lot of time finding. And this is the juice that pushes everything you have online up to the page one. So we will be pointing authoritative backlinks towards your website, towards your citations, towards your map listing, anything you have online that has one of these URLs, www.whatever, it can get a backlink. Okay? There's spammy backlinks, there's authoritative. Only you only want authoritative, right? Now for this, anybody looking for uh, you know, foundation repair who lives in this little area right here. Not this area, because your your map listing isn't optimized, and it's saying you're like serve the whole state, which is fine. But you know, when you can tune in, you know what I mean, sharpshoot, you can do some damage. So, for example, anybody living in this little area off of thirty, you know, in Irving, whenever they search for foundation repair, they're gonna see these top three. Okay, that's it. Now, let's say HD. Now, HD is green in a few areas, right? Mansfield, Cedar Hill, all through here, HD dominates. Let's, like, let's say South Fort Worth, accurate, HD. So anybody in South Fort Worth, they're going to see these top three businesses. Let's look up Acura's. So Acura is okay, but they're not the best. Let's say like South Lake, where some of the money's at. That's weird. You get the picture? So I'm gonna send you a copy of this. If you have any more information, you can always visit upshotsolutionsllc.com. Okay, I hope this was informative. Uh thank you for watching.